In October 2019, the government of Zimbabwe gazetted Zimbabwe's constitution amendment number two, which seeks to introduce several amendments to the 2013 constitution. These are the contents of the bill. One, a limit to parliament's powers to approve international treaties. Two, appointment instead of election of vice presidents. Three, extension of party list members of the National Assembly. Four, delimitation of electoral boundaries. Five, additional non-parliamentary ministers. Six, changes in the provisional and metropolitan councils. Seven, judicial reforms. Eight, appointment of prosecutor general. Nine, introduction of office of public protector. As Youths for Innovation Trust, we believe that party list members of the assembly who don't have constituencies are not productive. Their appointment is tokenistic and excludes. Parliament's powers should not be reduced because they are our voices. We need to implement our constitution before amending it, especially on devolution. The Judiciary, Electoral and Human Rights Commissions should introduce reforms and not amend the constitution. The, con the consultations for this bill are currently ongoing. Have your say. I am Kate Tuyamatu to give you 120 seconds of legislation.